When you've got absolutely nothing to lose, you can make some fairly outrageous decisions. In countries that enforce capital punishment and the death penalty, primarily the United States, it's a tradition to offer the prisoner a last meal of their choosing before their execution. The choices are generally pretty varied. Some inmates will choose an old favorite they haven't tasted since they were arrested, while others order mighty feasts. A few will ask for things they've never tried before out of curiosity and others will pick nothing as a silent protest. A few inmates, however, make choices that seem utterly bizarre to those around them. And it's these orders we have for you today. Here are the strangest last meal requests that were ever granted on death row. Ready? Let's get it on! Ronnie Lee Gardner The first on today's list is Ronnie Lee Gardner. His last meal doesn't sound too strange at first. However, what follows will truly surprise you. His meal consisted of steak, lobster tail, apple pie, and 7-Up, and there was nothing abnormal about the food he ordered. However, he also requested that he be permitted to watch the entire Lord of the Rings trilogy while he ate his final meal. His request was granted, and then he faced the firing squad shortly after. Thomas Grasso at the age of 32, Thomas committed a series of home invasions across the United States, which resulted in the death of two elderly homeowners. For his last meal, he ordered a hefty 24 mussels and clams, a Burger King double cheeseburger, six barbecued spare ribs, two strawberry milkshakes, a pumpkin pie with whipped cream, and a can of room temperature SpaghettiOs. His final words before his execution were, I did not get my SpaghettiOs. I got spaghetti. I want the press to know this. I almost feel bad for the guy. Almost. Lawrence Russell Brewer Before his execution, Brewer ordered fried chicken, steak with onions and gravy, a triple cheeseburger, large omelets, fried okra, half a loaf of bread, a pound of barbecue, a meat lover's pizza, three fully loaded fajitas, three cans of soda, peanut butter fudge, and a pint of ice cream. He was served all of it for his final meal, but didn't eat any of it. He just said he wasn't hungry. Texas stopped the last meal practice after this stunt. Philip Ray Workman Workman was a drug addict who held up a Wendy's fast food restaurant. Police arrived shortly after, alerted by the staff's silent alarm, and one cop was killed during the standoff. Workman was then sentenced to death and for his last meal requested that vegetarian pizzas be delivered to the homeless through the state. His request was refused, and he responded with a three-day hunger strike in protest. The story got out, and people throughout Tennessee began taking pizzas to homeless shelters across the state in support. Workman died without his last meal, but at least ended his life with one good consequence. Gerald Lee Mitchell Gerald received the death penalty for the murder of two men when he was 17 years old. He was eventually caught when he was found driving one of the murdered men's car. His choice of final meal was simply an assorted bag of Jolly Rogers candy. He proudly finished the entire bag. Peter J. Mignol Peter received a death sentence after he brutally murdered an associate. His last meal was one of the largest on record. It consisted of 20 beef tacos, 20 beef enchiladas, two double cheeseburgers, one jalapeno pizza, fried chicken, spaghetti, a small fruit cake, half a chocolate cake, half a vanilla cake, cookies and ice cream, caramel pecan fudge ice cream, two cans each of Coke, Pepsi, root beer and orange juice. David Leon Woods Not much to say about this one. When Woods faced his execution, he asked for a normal birthday cake as his last meal. It was not his birthday, but maybe he wanted to celebrate it for the very last time. James Edward Smith James decided to rob an insurance officer after he walked past and saw the clerk counting money. During his opportunist robbery, he shot and killed one of the insurance agents. At 37 years old, James was given the death penalty. Before his arrest, James was a practicing voodoo priest and tarot card reader in Houston, Texas. As his last meal, James requested a very specific jar of dirt. By most accounts, he didn't intend to eat the dirt, but instead used it to mark his body as a part of a voodoo ritual that would allow his spirit to move on and not become a ghost. His request was denied, and he got yogurt instead. If Houston now has haunted frozen yogurt stores, they only have themselves to blame. Ricky Ray Rector Ricky had three victims in one day. After killing a man in an Arkansas restaurant, he then shot and killed the police officer who was negotiating his surrender. Seeing no escape after that, Ricky turned the gun on himself. The attempted suicide failed, and it left him mentally impaired. He received the death penalty, and for his last meal chose an average meal of steak, 
chicken, cherry-flavored Kool-Aid, and pecan pie. It seemed like he didn't understand what was happening because he didn't eat the pie. Instead, he asked if he could save it for later. Odell Barnes Sentenced to death in 1989, Odell simply requested justice, equality, and world peace for his last meal. Unsurprisingly, prison officers weren't able to serve justice and equality for dinner. In the entree of world peace seemed a bit rich. I wonder what it would have tasted like, though. Robert Buell Buell chose a single black olive as his last meal. He chose this paying homage to Victor Fager, who was hanged in 1963. Fager had also requested a single olive, asking that the olive pit be placed in his shirt pocket before he was buried. A strange request, however, to many, an olive pit is a symbol of rebirth. The hope was that the olive seed would sprout and grow into a tree from the grave, a beautiful sentiment. Whether or not you agree with capital punishment, you can't argue that some good stories come from it. These are the strangest last meal requests by prisoners on death row of all time, as of now at least. Were you surprised by any? Leave us a comment and let us know why. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you would choose as your last meal. The most creative answer will be getting pinned. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our regular videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.